All right, so I'm on top of a, a uh, parking lot right now. I'm zoomed in right now so I can uh, so I could show you all the uh, the units on the rooftop and kind of down there too. There's an American Standard gas pack over there. A Goodman. It just turn on. Uh, two ream of roots and another good one behind that other ream. And then over there, there's two Trinix Bs right there, two Trinix B13s. Over there, I can kind of see a rood. Oh, and over there is a Carrier Comfort. And a Fujitsu, I think. And then there's many duckless mini splits right there. Over here on this side, um, there's a Trinix B13, an older one, right there. I'll zoom in with Clip Champ. And then over there, um, there's two Ameristars. I'll have to zoom in with Clip Champ as well. My camera doesn't zoom in all the way. And there's a few refrigerator components as well. So yeah. Oh, there's a tiny, there's a little bit of a Trinix R kind of hiding behind there. Not sure if you guys can see or not, but I'll zoom way in. Anyways, yeah. And over here, there's two carrier comforts that I've filmed before. Right there. There's two carrier comforts. I think that's a... Oh, did one of those trains just turn on? No, I keep hearing stuff. But yeah, there's two carrier comforts right there. I wish I could actually have access to this roof rooftop. Wow, that bird crap is actually the shape of a bird. <laughs> That's kind of funny. There's an old Ream Custom. Uh, I, or I think that's a Corsair, I'm, I'm not sure. Air Temp's way up there. Root Achiever, an old one. Uh, American Standard. I can't tell what that other one is. Um, those are some really vintage. Oh, those are York tomb, tomb, Tombstones, yeah. Um, there's a pane over there. I think that other one is also an air temp. Um, I almost landed on that lady over there. Um, there's a Carrier Comfort and a Train XB over there. And over here is a Train Gas Pack. Bryant Legacy Line, two Carrier Comforts, a little ream. Oh, a, a Root Achiever. Uh, actually, that's a Root Achiever. I can see the logo from here. An old carrier comfort, I think a newer one, and then a pain teardrop, Michibishi. And then units way up there, Goodman, American Standard, Carrier Tech 2000s, which I, actually I think I could hear. Our big Ream Classic, a Lennox Merritt, a carrier comfort over there, another carrier comfort over there. There's lots of units, oh, and not to mention, oh, there's more uh, tombstones. And over there, there's Way over there, there's Trinix B's right there, and then like three carrier gas packs. It's pretty cool. Oh, and a train Odyssey, and then a, a carrier CKC or YCC or B or C or AYC. So, yeah. Um, I think that's everything. Uh, so, yeah. Oh, I didn't even realize there's the. A Bryant and a Ream over there. I think I could hear. Um, any of these turned on over here? I'm about to end the video, by the way. And I do want to mention, over on the other side of the lot, um, is, um, yeah, over here. And up there. I don't know if you guys can hear or not, but that's probably a giant train odyssey with a really loud compressor. And right over here, we got uh, LG double stack, and then a Sanyo inverter right over there. These are running. And then here's another one over here that isn't running an LG double stack. Can't read that from here. I don't know if you guys can. Actually, I think I can. Uh, that is a... I feel like reading these okay. So yeah, that's really nice.
and over there, not so much, over, I'm trying not to drop my camera right now, I'm not sure what's down there, it's probably just empty space, Man, that is loud. Uh, it's just a little uh, alleyway, I guess. Yeah, there's nothing else. So yeah. Um. Yeah. Thank you for watching.